my sorority and love my life right now. Hey guys, it's Hope. Welcome, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, hello guys. I'm Hope. I'm a freshman at TCU and I'm doing another college week of my life. We are back on the grind of these videos. I've missed filming them, so we're just gonna do it. Um, so yeah, we're starting off. It's Monday, it's two o'clock. I just finished all my classes and I ran to the post office and I got a lot of stuff. Um, my mom sent me a Target package. She sent me like Valentine's Day gifts, which is so cute. And then I ordered some books on Amazon. So starting off the vlog very, very strong. And start it with my books because that's what I'm honestly very excited about. So let's open. I like know what I got, but I'm back into reading officially. So just like, let's spoil myself. Oh, did I only get one book today? Okay, only one of them showed up. Oh no, I think they're both in here. We'll see. I ordered two books, but only one came in, but this is the one I was more excited about, so I'm fine with it. It's Icebreaker by Hannah Grace. I know that this is her first novel, her debut novel, so I'm very excited to read it. I know it's compared to Off Campus, um, The Deal, which I love that book. It's a five-star read to me, so I'm so excited to read this next. I'm going to probably start this in the next couple days. Next, I'm opening up the package for my mom, and I can already tell that she spoiled me, so I love you, mom. First thing, ooh, is this little ring. It's so cute, it has little yellow um, hearts on it. Oh, this is so cute. I think I might be a little bit big. She got me a size eight. I think I'm a, yeah, this might be a little bit big, but I mean, I could wear it on my thumb. That's cute. Or on here, okay. I can make it work, it's really cute. She got me, oh my gosh, these fuzzy socks are so cute. They're from the paper store. Oh my gosh, these are so adorable. She got me my doll, which I think this is like for cramps, bloating, fatigue, headache, and backache. So basically this is period hell week in a medicine to get rid of it. Perfect. She sent me nasal spray because my nose is like always stuffy at school. All right, that is it. Thank you, mom. Now time for this big Target box. It looks like it's like 85 pounds, but it's really not. I don't know if it says how much it weighs. Definitely not more than like seven pounds. I'm so hungry. I cannot wait to eat and watch Keegan's new video. If you look inside, the reason it is such a big box is because she sent me like a ton of tissues because I blow my nose a lot. She sent me an eight pack of tissues, so thank you, mom. She sent me some face little towels. She sent me this hair clip that I'm actually so excited because it's big and it can hold all my hair, I think. So I actually want to try this like immediately. Okay, let's try this. I'm excited. It has like all my hair. That's crazy. Most hair clips like just don't hold all my hair up. Oh, that fell out, but I like it. It's very cute. Thank you, mom. She sent me some mouthwash and then she sent me my favorite chocolate. So thank you so much, mom. That is my haul. Welcome to the vlog. I'm so excited you're here and let's get into the week. Hello. So there's really not a lot to update you on. It's nine o'clock. And after I talked to you in the last clip, I took a nap for probably like an hour and a half maybe two hours. I don't know. I slept longer than I anticipated, but I needed to sleep. I didn't end up going to the gym. I woke up and I was going to get dinner with my friend Lauren, but I was like, I really need to get my tests done um, for one of my classes. So I went and I did that. Um, and I just ate in my room. I had some leftover chicken from last night and some yogurt to fill me up. So yeah, now I'm going to go take a shower. I also might read my book for a little bit trying to decide i like really thrive when i read things out loud but it's just like i can't obviously read my book out loud in my room when my roommates are in here that's just weird like imagine <laughs> that'd be funny but um <clears throat> i should do that one time and just see what they say <laughs> but um anyways i'm probably gonna read for a little bit and then take a shower i have an 8 a.m tomorrow um and i have to study for a quiz that I have tomorrow too so yeah, I'm feeling a little stressed if I'm being honest, just about classes and grades and 
I don't know. I thought the semester was going to be easier than last semester, but so far I've just been starting off a little bit slow, which is okay. It happens. There's tests, there's exams like that sometimes, but if you're going through that, you're definitely not alone. But yeah, that's my plan for the night. That's where I'm at. And I'll probably just talk to you guys tomorrow because tonight I'm just going to chill and then go to bed. So see you tomorrow. Hi, bays. I'm in the best mood ever because I just finished hanging out with my amazing friend Zoe. It's currently Wednesday at 10 o'clock. Um, I have an assignment due at 11. It's really easy. It's a discussion post for my theater class, but I'm actually going to take out my computer so I can do it. Sorry if the camera moved a little bit. My laptop moved the table, but anyway, I'm wearing my 80 pie sweatshirt and I love this thing. Let me show you the bat. Love it. I love my sorority. And then these are 80 pie sweatpants that I wear all the time. So yeah, I just got dinner with Zoe a couple hours ago. We went to this place called Fuzzies, which is this like TCU local taco place. It was super good. Mexican place. And it was really good. We had like deep life trauma dumps in the middle of this restaurant for like two hours straight. Then her boyfriend came and walked us back to my dorm and they left, but it was awesome. I love Zoe so much and her boyfriend, Ryan, he's a king. We joke that like, they're my parents. They are my parents here at school. I love them both. They're the best. But yes, I had that today. It was great. Tomorrow I'm going out with my friend Lauren for the first time that I'm so excited about. I love Lauren. She's a queen. Love you. Um, I'm in the best mood. Today's been a great day. I didn't get to go to the gym, but it's okay because I walked so much today. I walked and like closed all my Apple movement ring. So that's great. Um, but anyways, I need to do this assignment. Um, I didn't vlog at all yesterday, I don't think. I just went to the gym off campus um, during the prime time. I went at like five o'clock, six o'clock, super busy. I also had a meeting for Frog Aids. Um, I haven't talked to you guys about that. I did in my first vlog ever when I was going to like the information session about it. And I actually ended up getting in like five months later. I'm still, I got in and I love it. It's an amazing, opportunity for me to push me outside of my comfort zone and be around people that are different than me and a lot more extroverted than I am. I seem extroverted right now, but just because I'm off of like energy high of like being with great people. But um, I just feel really lucky. I am happy. But anyways, um, I went to my meeting last night after my workout. I went off campus to the gym. And then I went to my meeting and we're doing big project right now, which basically in Frog Age, we work on a small project or a like group project with just like five to like seven people. The beginning of the semester, we work on something. Um, my group did a positive affirmations coffee bar, which was awesome. It was super fun. We basically went and got all the supplies and made coffees and we're in like the student union sort of area, like by the cafeteria or by the dining hall and we like can free coffee out to people if they wrote a nice note for the next person so it was super fun that was last semester and this semester we were doing a big project that every single person's doing there's 50 of us in the cohort and we're actually doing like a special needs dance party for them we're gonna make an awesome week out of it it's gonna be like homecoming for people with disabilities and if you guys don't know I did go into college as a special education major. I wanted to be a special ed teacher, but since then I changed to child development because the path to become a special ed teacher at TCU is very complicated. Um, if you want me to talk more about it, I can. I've told the story like 50 times to like people in person, so I don't like talking about it all the time, but it's not bad at all. It just wasn't what I wanted to do anymore. So I'm child development right now, just so I can kind of figure out what I want to do. And I plan to switch to speech pathology. It, I can still work with people with disabilities there, but I ideally would like to work with people with intellectual disabilities specifically. Um, two of my best friends have Down syndrome. I love them, they're the best. And they're on my wall, my picture wall, and I look at them every day. They make me so happy, they inspire me, they make me a better person. And I just wanna work with people like them because they teach me so much. And if I can give back to them, even a little bit of the happiness and amazing life advice that they gave to me, I'd love to do that. And speech path is more flexible than teaching. Um, there's more opportunity to grow in the field that I want. And 
it's very flexible like so in a little while when I want babies I can be a stay-at-home mom if that's the case anyway I'm just in a great mood but yeah that's kind of where I'm at I have an assignment due in an hour so I'm gonna go do that that was my day it was so great I love my life right now okay but I love you guys so much and I will talk to you tomorrow it's gonna be Thursday going out tomorrow I'm excited about it so yeah I love you guys and I'll talk to you tomorrow. Also took my first psychology exam today. It cut me off, but I got a 92 on it. So woo! My first really good grade this semester. So go me. Alright, see you guys tomorrow. Peace. Good morning everybody. It is currently 9:30. 9:28 to be quite exact. On Thursday morning. I woke up, I went to my 8 a.m. class and I just got out and now I'm back at my room. I have a really exciting, fun-filled day, but I'm tired because I only got like six and a half hours of sleep, but it's okay. Um, basically, here's my little to-do list. I wrote it and put a little smiley face and he's sticking out his tongue. So basically, here's my to-do list. Wake up, have breakfast, get ready, go to my 8 a.m., get ready for the gym, go to the gym, get my nails done. I don't know if you can tell, but my nails are very grown out. I've had these on, not on, but I get gel and I haven't gotten them done in like over a month. And my nails grow super quick. And I have like a mixer on the 17th, so in like a week, literally a week from tomorrow. So I want to get my nails done cute. It's like a Valentine's Day mixer. And then I might go shopping at American Threads because it's right by the nail salon I go to. I was going to get a dress for the mixer, but I have a really cute pink one I think I'm just going to wear. Um, that I love. It's so cute. I wore it during um, prep day for Rush. Um, maybe go to the store, but I don't think I'll have time. I don't know why. I just like completely forgot I had class at 2 o'clock. I was like, I can do all of this and go to the store and just like have the whole rest of the day till I go out. I literally have class at 2. So I have to kind of like make this quick. I need to eat lunch at some point. I'd like to relax some point of the day, probably after my class. I can just chill, read my book, do homework, and maybe tan. Cause if we go out tonight, I want to be tan. But if not, we are going to go out tonight. I just don't know if I'll tan. I've been saying I'm going to tan since I've been back at school. It's been like a month. So it'll happen. Just don't know if that's today. Shower, eat dinner, and then go out and have fun. So that is my to-do list, and I can check off my 8 a.m. class. Um, I do need to call my mom and figure out my gym membership because I had to like renew it. So I'm gonna do that and then get ready for the gym and see you guys when there's an update. I have to like do my dishes, so I'm probably gonna do that. Get ready and then go to the gym. I'm excited so. Welcome to Thursday, ladies and gents. If you guys remember, I think it was on like Monday, I was just talking about how it's getting off to a slow start in some of my classes. And I just checked my religion grade and it went up so much. I'm so happy. So that's great. I did really well on my psych test yesterday. Um, sorry, my back. My language development test is also going to go up a little bit because I did extra, I got some extra credit points. I'm going to do some extra credit for religion next Thursday. I'm going to a like event they're having, so I'll get some points for that. Um, and it's all working out. So excited about that. I'm going to go to the gym. I got my like everything I needed figured out for that. And I'm really hoping I have time to go to the gym. Well, I'm really hoping I have time to get my nails done. I'm going to call the nail salon after I finish at the gym before I like Uber to the nail salon to make sure like they can take me. So yeah, I'm really excited. I really just thought I cannot wait to vlog next weekend. Like my formal or my, not my formal, my mixer is going to be so much fun. Yeah. I also really want to finish my book. I've been like really wanting to finish that. My eyes are dry. I have a lot going on, clearly. So, okay. I'm gonna cut up some apples and peanut butter, then I'm gonna do my dishes, and then I'm gonna get ready for the gym. Okay, bye. Hey, vlog. Vlog. Oh my gosh, I'm tired. Hey, vlog. Long time no talk. I look super glowy. I'm wearing my Rare Beauty highlighter, as always, in the shade. Let's see. In the shade Mesmerize. I'm obsessed with this. I 
I love Rare Beauty. Um, I will be doing a formal get ready with me video because I have a mixer next Friday for my sorority. But anyway, I haven't vlogged in a few days. Thursday was a really fun day. I just didn't vlog because I was like doing a bunch of stuff and trying to live in the moment. My friend, um, yesterday was Friday. I just hung out. I did a girls night. I got my nails done and probably will be up by now, but I did a Friday night at my life in college, self-care edition. I showed you guys my nails, getting food by myself. That was kind of it, but it was a really cute video. I really like it. I'm going to probably upload it tonight, honestly, just because I have nothing else to do. And it's Saturday. I woke up really early this morning. I woke up at like, mm, what, like nine? I woke up at like nine, I think. Well, I woke up at 8.30 and get out of bed to like 8.50 probably. But I did that. I got up. I got ready somewhat. And I went to my sorority recruitment practice. It was supposed to be from 10 to 3, but it was only until like 10 to 12.45. It was not long at all. It was so fun. I'm so excited for recruitment. I can't wait to film that vlog. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. So I can't wait for that. Can't wait for the house, like living in the house and all that content that will bring to my channel. I'm so excited about that. Then um, I came back, I got into my basketball attire and went to the basketball game. We lost to Baylor by four points and we were winning the entire, basically like the entire second half. I'm mad, I don't wanna talk about it, but we lost by four. Um, well, we do look good. Like our team looks good. We just need to learn how to put a game away. But then I just went and got some dinner with some girls um, that I went to the game with. And then, yeah, I'm tired. So I'm going to lie in my bed. And I'm also going to eat a little bit of chocolate because I really want it. So, yeah. <laughs>